Hey everybody, my is Brother Derek here. I already shot three videos in the past hour, but we gotta shoot another one. Um, we got a mark, and this is the reason that AEW is in the position that it's in because you got these little dick marks that got pictures of Sky Blue and Tony Storm up on the wall, and they jacking off to them. But they want to tell you that AEW is fine. And these are the people that keep AEW from actually becoming something. They accept it. He want to tell me about my production. Yeah. I lay down in the bed make my videos. But it's not the production that will come out of my mouth. You may fun in the way I talk, yeah, I stutter. Yet. Yeah. I've never been out roasted. But you'll pick on me, but you accept the bullshit the AEW sent you. That Sky Blue match was terrible. And she took Selena Vega's move, and that looked horrible. Anna J is horrible. Who wants to look at a she-he like Nala Rose? Why they keep putting out Maria Shafir? She sucks. She got no personality. She try to look mean. You look at her eyes and you see nothing. Who's training these people? But you don't say nothing. But you'll say something to somebody who just raises the question. You want to attack my production. But yet, how many times... Has AEW screen went blank on you? How many times have they had production problems? You don't say nothing. But you say something to me. That's why I'm coming to get you. I'm not going to take it. I took time out my day to bring up issues. But you don't talk about the issues. The issue was AEW. The issue was not Minister Brother Dark. But this is the problem with you marks. So you keep on jacking off the sky blue and Tony Storm and Soraya flabby butt cheeks. Purpose of bringing Soraya in for gave her the championship just for that Wembley thing. She made what, what? Two defenses? And they took the belt right off her. Keep giving it to Hero Hushida. Who the heck want to see Hushida in the ring? Get it to Athena or Willow Nightingale. How many two, three-time champions he gonna have? He had like he's scared to put the belt on somebody else. Keep putting Orange Cassidy out there. Orange Cassidy is a joke. But yeah, put him on the card. Don't have him in main event title matches. He a joke. The best friends, they're a joke. All these Spanish wrestlers, nobody care about. Keep putting them in our face. All these Japanese wrestlers, we don't know. Who cares? Well, AEW does well in the UK. You know why? Because in the UK, they don't let them have commercials. That's why they like to watch AEW, because it's commercial free over there. When you do the picture in picture, they see everything. Why like you got to look at the little picture picture, watch the commercial. That's why they watch. If you don't do your homework, don't comment. If you don't know what you're talking about, don't comment. Think before you comment. I made the comment based on what you said that I went and looked you up and I saw that you've been on YouTube for 12 years and you ain't picked up that one subscriber. You've been on YouTube for 12 years and you ain't made not one video. How are you qualified to tell somebody something? That's like somebody to just get the car and drive it, tell a mechanic how to fix their car. You have no experience. Well, I've watched many a video, but you ain't done one. So you want to tell somebody what to do. Make a video and show me. But better yet, why don't you let AEW know to stop putting out this indie bull crap that we got to watch every day all week. We need AEW to keep WWE from getting lazy like they was. I ain't watched Raw yet, but I heard it was a lazy one tonight. 
Why are they getting lazy again? Because AEW ain't no competition. And we need to work on that. Make AEW competition. I don't need no fancy production to tell you that. AEW, you need to step it up. They trying to sell you a product. They want you to spend $50 on that pay-per-view. I ain't asking you to spend a dime. But you don't ask them to step that game up, but you give them your money. You give them your money and don't ask them to do nothing, but you got to to step to somebody who ain't asking for nothing from you. That's the problem. That's why they're not getting better. And for your information, sexy time, we were using that for a long time. It's copyright free. We ain't got to worry about YouTube. Coming at the the music you hear now is from the YouTube library. But I make my own music. I can play my music. I wanted to make a quick video and I went to the second time. It was easy, just hit that one button. But here's the key. The video was about AEW, but you made it about me. And that's the problem. You worry about the wrong things. The crap that Tony Khan gave you is acceptable to you. It's acceptable. Why? Why is it acceptable to you? The rest of the matches are too long. They're too phony. Everybody kick out of everything. The sorry is bum kick out of everything. Where's the domination at? They're supposed to be larger than life. I don't want to see somebody play basketball that I could beat. I don't want to see somebody play baseball I could beat. I want to see larger than life superstars, people who I go, wow, I wish I could do that. When I see them doing all them gymnastics, all the jump over the top rope and all that stupid stuff, they don't hurt. You ain't never seen nobody win a fight with none of that stuff. The realism for the wrestling is gone. They all cooperating. And it's ridiculous that y'all sit there and cheer that crap. Y'all better go there and, and make chance. Fight forever. This is awesome. When you're supposed to be going there to see somebody get beat up. You're supposed to go there to see the villains get crushed. To get their comeuppance. That's what Professor Russell is based on. Not on the crowd sitting there chanting. Chat the F out. It's you sissies that's ruining the sport. You have ruined it. Go look at the old Mid-South. Look at the old ladies that were trying to kill the rule breakers back then. They were trying to stab them. Jim Cornette and them. If they came out and their ties wasn't slashed, they were surprised. Y'all cheer for the villains now. You ruined the sport. You have ruined the sport. So like I said, before you give somebody advice, step your game up. Why do I keep saying that? With no subs. With no videos. How you going to tell somebody who has over 3,000 videos, over 40, 24 different channels, how you going to tell me how to make a video? Huh? Make a video and show me how to make a video. Let's see how many views you get. Oh, you ain't got no subs. Who's going to see it? YouTube is not going to promote it. But you want to tell me how to do what I've been doing since 2017. You gonna tell me how to do something? I lay in the bed, make my video, and the people still watching. How many people watch you? Uh, nobody. Who cares about your opinion? Uh, nobody. So have a nice day. Minister Robert Dark. I'm out. Peace, everybody.